So the iPad has um, great, like extremely changed my note taking um, in class. So before I used to be a strictly like paper, pencil, notebook type of note taker. Um, I realized for this entirety of the program, like the iPad, I am strictly taking notes on the iPad using the notes app. And I use um, a app called GoodNotes, which I do pretty much everything off of. I have all of my books, like um, all of my books, like I don't use anything paper anymore so all of my books are on the iPad and I'm able to utilize everything that I need from here. The iPads made my study habits a lot more efficient. Um, I feel that I'm utilizing my time a lot more than I was without it. Um, it's it's really on the go. I study here and then if I'm on the shuttle I can just take it with me and study over there, you know, utilize what little time I had which I wouldn't be doing before that. So it's made it better, it's made it more efficient, and I feel like I'm utilizing my time in a much, much better way. Um, what I find most helpful about the iPad is the ability um, to, inter like the different uh, split screens, I find most helpful. I do a lot with split screen, and then obviously having it be an Apple product, I also find it helpful that like Sonia said, like you're able to interface so I can have something that was strictly on the iPad. I can go to my MacBook, I can go to my phone and it's all the same information, um, which is, I find extremely helpful. So as far as collaboration, again, we'll, we usually hold group study up here. And so we're able to, for example, pull something up to the screen. We do practice questions together on the screen. We do, we watch videos or um, when we did used to facilitate like last semester, we did study sessions where we zoomed and were in person. Um, the iPad makes it extremely easy to be able to do all of that and to do multiple things at once. I mean, um, also not just here, but we've taken it to clinicals and there are apps on here like uh, Hippocrates that we really use in clinicals. So it's really easy to be able to take our notes that we take in class into the field and access them over there where you know we can't do that with our laptops. And you could just pull up anything we want over there, any definition or any um, disease process. It's very, very easy. So we have, um, we have a Dropbox for our class and we have a lot of textbooks and such on it. And one of the things on the um, Dropbox is like the Saunders book and it has all the NCLEX questions that we could do. And it's really helpful because I'll be um, on the shuttle coming to campus and I'll just pull up the iPad and I can do it. And I don't need internet for that because it's already on there. Um, and then, or at night, we can do questions, like, as, uh, like Jenny said, on ATI, it's, it's there. I would probably just add, like, it's, it's extremely easy, efficient. Um, and the, I think especially um, what Dr. O'Neill, one of our professors, um, was explaining with making sure that it's HIPAA compliant when we are at clinicals was extremely, extremely, extremely helpful in being able to use it, being able to have that as a resource to have books to make sure that we're prepared and that we know what we're talking about. I think it's easy, it's efficient, and it's very portable. I think also, um, along with the iPads, we were given the iPencil, and it's, it's kind of like a trick thing for people that need to write down information in order to remember. It works because with iPencil, you can write on the iPad, and it, it tricks your mind into thinking that you're actually doing the old school way. Meanwhile, it's retaining everything, and then everything is readily accessible to you. You don't have to flip pages or you know, waste paper, so it's eco-friendly.